So uh, in the November election, I demonstrated my ability to work with people across the aisle. I was uh, blessed enough to get the endorsements from people from both the, the Democratic side, my, my former opponent, my current opponent, opponent uh, the Republican, uh, Tom Carroll and uh, Mark Smiley. I don't think Mark's here, but I saw Tom earlier. Uh, I, I think that uh, when you go and you have any type of relationship uh, with uh, someone, your political issues should be put aside and it should be based solely based upon uh, two humans having an interaction one-on-one -on -one with each other. Uh, and I think that when I get elected, when I'm up at the State House, I'm going to be in a unique opportunity and have a unique position uh, to be a bridge across the aisle for uh, two uh, bipolar parts of the General Assembly right now on specific issues. Uh, some issues that I don't necessarily agree with uh, with members of the left, uh, I agree with, with members of the right and vice versa. Uh, so therefore, whenever there's a topic that may come up for discussion, um, they're not worrying about whether or not I'm going to be a constant adversary for them. Uh, they were looking at, they're going to look for me uh, for ways to see that we can compromise and come to uh, ways that are going to be beneficial for all the members of the state, all the members of District 68, uh, not just the people that are a member of that particular political party.